Hi, my name is Georgina Mota. I'm a final year student at the University of Pretoria. I'm currently busy with my engineering degree. Well, it has been a challenging experience for me to get where I am today with my studies. First of all, the high school that I went to, there was a lack of facilities. For example, we didn't have laboratories where we can do our science experiments. There were no computers where students can be taught to be computer literate. And most of the time, the classes were overcrowded because there was about 50 students which were the responsibility of just one teacher. Fortunately, there was a selected few students that were able to go for extra classes on Saturdays for their maths, science, and also for communication. But there was only a few, a few selected, which was about three from every, from every 50 students. When I got to my, when I started at high school, I didn't know the subjects that were offered at technical school, but the combination of the subjects when I got there, it was so interesting that it made me want to study engineering. The problem came when my marks were not good enough when I finished high school. My marks were not good enough for me to get into the four-year program, but when I came to varsity at the University of Pretoria, I was offered to enroll into a program which is called the Engage program. This is basically an extended program which takes a year longer, about five years. And this is so popular that even students that have marks that are good enough to get into the four-year program, they even enroll for this program, the Engage program. It, this, is, it, this is because this program, it offers a structured, a structured support by means of augmented modules. These modules, they involve uh, a background of the main modules that the students will be doing in their first and their second year at the varsity. Basically, the background, it gives background on basic sciences such as physics, math, and chemistry. Say, for example, you come from high school. High school, calculus was done as a section, but when you get to varsity, Calculus is done as a module on its own, and that could be so much pressure, but the augmented modules, they will help a student to be able to adjust to the new subjects that they're doing at the university. The ENGAGE program also includes professional orientation as a subject. This helps the students to be able to improve on their communication skills, their life skills, and their problem-solving skills. This can also help them to be able to write reports, and this is very essential for students that are doing engineering. Well, one might look, might look at this as too much work, but the workload, yes, it is more, but it is there to help you because the students, the students have to do the augmented modules and still do the main subjects for engineering. But with all these supports, being put in place. The students, is still, uh, the students are still expected to be able to pay for their tuition, pay for books and other learning materials, accommodation, and also meals. And this can add up to a sum of about 70,000, which is a phenomenal sum for most students, which they cannot afford immediately. But, if there are companies that are willing to donate to help these students and to make a success of this program, the ENGAGE program, the, the university, here at the university, we will express our appreciation by issuing a tax rebate certificate according to the Income Tax Act. Also, corporate companies, corporates can also claim up to 110% of any donation made towards their BBEEE scorecard. The university is also willing to negotiate marketing opportunities for companies that are willing to donate. If you want to support a student and if you are also willing to help to make this program be a success, please email to this email, link up at up.ac.za and you can get more information there. Thank you.